What's up, fight fans? This is Kurt DeVille with Counter Punch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Luis King Kong Ortiz and Deontay Wilder. Of course, we've seen Ortiz immediately after the first round destruction of Dominique Brazil. And he was able, along with his translator, to give a statement to be interviewed after that fight as though he was that fight. Now, he stated his interest in fighting Deontay Wilder once again. Um, there was mad respect from Ortiz to Wilder. And I think that he was in the ring for a particular reason. I think that was orchestrated, guys. And it was orchestrated because he was in the ring the same reason that he didn't fight Joshua. He's, he was in the ring last night, okay? The fight with Deontay Wilder, a rematch, is going to be ordered by Al Heyman. I think that fight will be made. And I think everything is going according to plan. When you have a stable of fighters and you're kind of advisor, manager, promoter, like Heyman, you want to keep all these fights in-house. Since you want those fights in-house, you want to make sure that you have all your particular, your, your, you know, your A fighters to your B fighters to your C fighters. So we're clearly showing that Dominic Brazil is more close to a C fighter at this point. You know, when he goes up in competition, he might beat a B fighter, you know, because of course, Luis Ortiz and, and Dominic Brazil hasn't fought yet. It would be unfair to say, oh, Luis Ortiz would beat Dominic Brazil. He might beat Dominic Brazil. He hasn't fought Dominic Brazil, to be fair, guys. But Luis Ortiz going 10 rounds with Deontay Wilder shows that he had to have some skill to get to that round, okay? And to hurt Deontay Wilder and damn near knocked him out. And it would have been considered a knockout according to certain referees, I mean, judges, right? Well, referees, I was right. So I think that a fight will be made between them and those two guys because that's the easiest fight to be made. Deontay Wilder needed another opponent, which that's what Luis Ortiz was set aside for. Of course, like I said, that's why he didn't take the Joshua fight because he couldn't take the Joshua fight because he was a pawn and another person's puzzle piece, okay? He's a pawn, he's a piece of the puzzle in Deontay Wilder's puzzle piece because Deontay needed an opponent later this year, okay? This is just May, people. So he needs uh, that second fight for this year. And that second fight is, you know, no other than Luis King Kong Ortiz. Of course, Ortiz wants that chance to redeem himself. The question is, guys, do you want to see that fight? Do we want to see, uh, a, you know, a, a redo of Wilder Ortiz? I mean, and I'm an Ortiz fan, as you guys know, but I don't... I don't know how good he could do versus the first time. Will he learn anything from fighting Deontay Wilder? Will Deontay Wilder learn anything from them? You know, that's why it it would raise some questions. I, I, I would watch it, but of course, I would want to see him fight Tyson Fury again or AJ, definitely. Those are super fights because those are fighters. Those are other champs or champions or top fighters in the division. And they're all undefeated, mind you. OK, he's been in there with Tyson Fury. He's already been in there with uh, King Kong Ortiz. He's knocked out Dominic Brazil, which which is mandatory. So that's something that he was mandated to do. Um, but I think that Ortiz. If he gets it and this is me, if he gets the fight with Ortiz these days, it's not really if he win, loses or draws. It's. We know he's a little older because he's 40 years old now, according to paper, okay? I think he should get his just reward, you know? Um, I think he should get at least a million, two, three million plus to get in the ring to fight the champ because um, because if Deontay Wilder is supposedly making all this money now that he can't talk about, I think they should give Luis Ortiz a lot more money that he can talk about. But anyway, that's me wrapping it up on this segment. You guys tell me what you think about a rematch between Deontay Wilder and Luis King Kong Ortiz. Please subscribe. And you guys have been counterpunched.
Peace.